Hello Z-Bird, welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains. Today we are starting our free play adventure. Of course, at this point we have played through the main story once and we have also played through all the Justice League levels as well. So now our goal is to go back into them with all of the characters we need to unlock all the mini kits, all of the red bricks, all of the golden bricks, all of the stud things, whatever we need to get, we'll be getting in this series or I guess a secondary series, whatever you might want to call it. After we're done with that, we'll be going through the overworld of the entire game game, which is all of this and all of that and everything all over the place. And we'll be exploring that and getting everything done there. So there is a huge list of things to do that we're not gonna be worrying about at the moment. Like I said, we're gonna start with the story levels with the first level, which is New Kid on the Block. I just have to find out where that is and we'll get started. Okay, so here it is, here's the level select. We're just gonna start with New Kid on the Block. And as you can see, we still have two more gold bricks, one mini kit. A Apparently we're only, oh, you know, these are for certain areas. Okay, so like we have one mini kit in the first area, one of the, whatever the Joker thing is, we actually got the full stud counter, so let's just go ahead and get started with Strikers Island and see what we end up finding. So here we are on Strikers Island, the very first segment of that was playable in the game outside the, I, mean, I don't think there was too much in the prologue, so we just need to move over to a flyable character. Oh, uh, do we have, can Lex fly? Wait, what's happening? No, no selfies, I didn't want you to do a selfie. No, wait, no, 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 still don't want a selfie. <laughs> Okay, so that's weird. I sort of changed the controls around a little bit. Uh, here we go, here is a uh, Black Adam. He can definitely fly. And I just need to sort of find our way around with everything. Um, I did notice this up here, which actually might be our little Joker spray thing. Luckily, I was actually able to play through the entire game without getting a single kit or single red brick or anything. So if you're watching this for a walkthrough, you should be able to you know, find your way through with the free play seg segment pretty well. Anyways, let's go ahead and try to find the Joker. Uh, it will take me some time to you know, really learn where all the characters are in the select, which is weird. You think Joker would be to the top, but he's just right here in the middle. Anyways, we gotta use the Joker and just try this out. Okay, <laughs> over uh, Nightwing here, we put Joker's face. And what does that do for us? Oh, and then we take a selfie. How devilish, I love it. And that gave us, I think, our thing, awesome. So not too much to worry about there. And then we're only looking for one kit, I think in this immediate area, so let's try to find it. Um, okay. Oh, here's another Joker. Okay, so where, no, 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 that's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I keep on thinking that'll be my other character select button, but it's just not, it's weird. Hmm, I do have a lot to get used to, but I feel like it's up here. There, okay, there is some glass I can break with this. Don't know who can do that, though. Ooh, some gold we can bust, which my character can do. Where am I at, Zebra Man? Get to it, Zebra Man. Got it, and got it. Okay, so with that done, what did that do? Or maybe that's, maybe that's nothing. I don't know, it looks like maybe there's something I can build with all that. Oh, there we go. Okay, what is this? Oh, is this one of the uh, teleportation things? Looks like it to me. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab that. And who can do this? I don't think anybody we have selected at the moment so let me go ahead and take a look. Like we have Heat Wave, like who can do this? That guy can, which we actually might have him in our quick select actually. Yep, here he is right here. And can he just forget how he does this? Another one of these things. I'll handle it. There we go. And where does this bring us? Uh, It's not working. Weird. Was that not right? Well, let's see what Johnny DC has to say. Tap square. And then he'll just make it work. I guess we have to set it up on both sides? Is that the thing? Because it's set up. I think that we gotta find another side to set it up on. So let's look around for that. And also, who do we have in our team that can break glass? Because there's a secret character in there, I saw that. Okay, Um, this is weird. Where's my other character at? Can you turn into a, yeah, flying character. Black Adam would be perfect. There you are and look around a little bit. Where could there be another one? I'm really bad at this so far. Because <laughs> I know I need to destroy that computer to find you know where I'm supposed to be going next, but hmm. So far, I'm not really seeing where there could be another teleport spot. Like maybe I'm misunderstanding, but usually you just jump through it. Anyways, I guess in the meantime, we really should try to find a way to break this glass. It just doesn't tell us which characters can. I don't remember. Oh, the flash can. Okay, reverse flash. What can he do to it? This is your only warning, world. Uh, first flash has arrived. Oh, he can just run around real fast. That almost did it. 
Maybe if I just keep going? It's like shivering. Oh, what? That is so weird. Oh, I do think I see the, the laser, or not the lasers, beyond the lasers, I think I see the other half of the, the thing. Oh, there it is, yeah, 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 okay, got it. So now if I go back up there, as anybody can fly, really, this has actually gotten quite tedious already. We just gotta sort of figure everything out as we go, I suppose. Go ahead and go through, and, or not, come on. Can only the mirror master do it? Oh, and there, I, I just passed him. There he is. There we go, and there we go, there's our first kid in the game, zero, or one out of five, from zero out of five. That's our first one, so yeah, we got a lot more work to do as we explore more of it and try to figure it out. So let me try to get that secret character. So I think Batman can also do this, looks like it, and then he can go in here and grab it. Oh, new character, awesome. So I don't know if there's anything else around here, but I'll keep looking, and if not, we'll move into the next area. Okay, that was one out of five right there. So I'm guessing we gotta find some different speakers around here. I do not see any others. Oh, here's some. We'll try to destroy as many of these as we can just right now. Oh, here's three out of five. Cause this will obviously, usually whenever it's anything out of any number, like if you do something and you, you get a number for it, that means that if you do it enough times, you should get a kit. So I don't see any others around here, but if I find them, I'll definitely take them out. But I just gotta keep destroying stuff until we find what we gotta find. So we're in another area now. And oh, there are some more of this, uh, there we go, four to five, which probably means somewhere around here, there is another one. So I'll be, oh, right here. So there's five out of five, nice. Perhaps this has hidden magical properties. It may. Am I supposed to be threatened by the likes of you? Please. <laughs> okay, uh, so there is more stuff done. And what about this over here? I mean, I know Joker can normally do this, right? But did we have Joker in this area? I don't think we did. I don't remember this. So we'll try this out real fast. I mean, there were some kids we probably could have already done that I just didn't do. So let's see if Batman can't do this. Uh, where, where am I, where is this leading? Oh, there's a button over this way. Gotcha. And that button will just give us a kit. Nice and easy, awesome. So let's go over there and get that one if we could. I uh, just need to switch over to a character that can get over to it. And that's already kid, what, three out of five? We're doing pretty well. Okay, so I did notice that this thing over this way, we definitely haven't done before. Whatever this lock is, ooh, there's an electric character thing. Do we have an, yeah, we got, of course we got Black Adam. Let's try this out. Oh, I can already see the kid to the left. Yep, this is definitely gonna be one. So four out of five already. Wow, we we're doing really well. But I think, I remember looking, there was only three kits in this area, so we should be good to move on to the next one. Okay, so now we're at the clock tower part where I know there's the remaining, how many? Uh, two or one? One? One kit and then one red brick. So that'll be easy enough to do, right? And what's nice about this clock tower is that if I can just get a flying character, I should just be able to fly around and up most of it and not have to worry about actually traversing it. And this should make it way, way easier for actually finding everything too, so I can just sort of, you know, zoom around, take a good look at everything, try to remember where I've been, where I haven't been. Like, I don't think I've destroyed this box before, if you even can. Uh, let's just try to lower ourselves. Doesn't look like we can, okay. So that might not be anything important. Cause I know Harley Quinn can get up and around this, and then she gets up this way, and blah, 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 and then we do this, and we're like, whoa, wow! And then we're up here, where there's Cheetah and Wonder Woman and Cyborg and stuff. It is cool seeing everybody fight. Ooh, here we go, this is golden, and I don't think we've yet to destroy it. Let's give it a shot now. I mean, who can, no, that's not what I wanted. Uh, Who can destroy it? Well, Zebra can. Where's Zebra Man at? I don't know when he got replaced in my character select wheel, but he did. And got him. Oh, that's the red brick! I didn't even notice, yeah, the gargoyle's holding the red brick. Awesome, let's get it, and, wait, 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 get up here. Can I not jump high enough? Got it, awesome, our first ever red brick. I wonder what it is. That'll be super exciting to find out. Hopefully it is a stud multiplier, but we'll find out later on. So where in the world is some other stuff? Because in this area, ooh, maybe there's something with this. Uh, Batman can do this, right? Looks like Cyborg can too. Tap circle, okay, and this is, Probably a kit. We're looking for one last one, so if this is it, then this is it. Uh, and beyond all these boxes, boom, we got ourselves the final kit. Yeah, it is another clue. So if we take a look again, we've gotten all five kits, the secret character, the red brick, the four gold bricks, the one spray paint, and 100% on the stud meter. We are good to move forward. However, I find out how to end this level, I, I don't remember. <laughs> Might be with building this. Uh, 
Ooh, sort of, kind of, right? And these are the chattering teeth. So, uh, we hop on top of those. I think I might need to be the Joker for that. Which I don't, yeah, we, we do have the Joker. So, hop on top, and we need Harley Quinn, which I guess instead we're just gonna have this guy. Okay, so there we go. New kid on the block completed. Super excited to see, and, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll find out how much we got out of everything. Hopefully we can find out what that red brick was from here, but if not, we'll find out later. But we got all five of the kits in the first level. I'm gonna be trying to do the first five levels in today's episode to see how long that takes. Might take us a while, this might take me a lot while. We get the Daily Planet newspaper for doing that, cool. And of course we got the Helium mode. I don't know what that means, probably that everybody talks with a high-pitched voice. Not a stun multiplier, unfortunately, but we did get the uh, selfie with the thing and we got the mini kits and the picture perfect, that's what it is. So very, very cool, all four gold bricks out of that, which means we even got the secret character. I can't wait to see who that is. I'm not really very familiar with it. Well, let's find out, it is Cheshire. Hmm, like Cheshire Cat? I don't, I don't know what she does. Anyways, there we go, there's the first level new kid on the block, so we're gonna exit this level and make our way to the next one. Okay, so we're back in Metropolis, so all we gotta do is go to the map menu again, and now that we'll get a cool little star for fully completing that, how awesome is that? Now we're gonna move over to It's Good To Be Bad, where we do have two levels to do. The first one is GCPD, which has three kits at the Picture Perfect. We still have to do the full stud meter and the secret character, so the first area is very jam-packed. And then the second area only has two kits and the red brick. So hopefully throughout all that we can figure it out, especially I'll just sort of have to take my time getting all the studs for it. So I'm just gonna start with Joker, that should be good enough. So I'll keep you guys along with the ride because we'll have to thoroughly explore everything if we really wanna get all those studs. But I can, you know, get started with that once the level begins. All right, so here we are at the GCPD. There's lots to do around here. I don't exactly remember which ones we have done and which ones we haven't, but I'll be trying to be careful not to do the thing that'll force us to move forward with the level. Because sometimes that happens, you know, is that uh, you'll be playing a level and you're still getting stuff done in the area, but then you accidentally trigger the thing that moves you to the next area and you can't go back without restarting the level. That's always the biggest pain, especially if we're trying to get full stud meter because we'd have to get everything done again. So I'm gonna be careful of that. I'll just do whatever I can. Can this guy leave me alone? I mean, I guess I've defeated a couple of bad guys that add to my stun multiplier. I'm sure we're gonna need like 100 or 200,000 studs to get everything going, so I'll do what I can. But right now, just you know, normally collecting studs should also help, and also switching to some flying characters and getting that kind of stuff figured out would also be probably a good idea. For right now, though, destroy everything. Like, literally just destroy everything in sight until we get a full stud meter. And I figured that, you know, if I do have studs to earn, I'll keep you guys along with the ride and just try to enjoy it with you guys. And a lot of you have been requesting since I finished the main Justice League story mode that I get back to doing more episodes. So I hope you guys are enjoying the free play. Like I've said before, we'll try to do about five levels an episode, which might mean that they're a little few and far between at first because it does take a while to record these just because it might be a short video for you, but it's quite a long one for me getting through everything. So we'll get Clayface through there in just a moment. I wanna keep exploring this for a bit. But yeah, once we're done with this, we'll free roam the city, and that'll be a lot of fun. Okay, so I can't really move around that way too much. So let's uh, switch to, yeah, freeze, dude. And maybe this could be something. Let's get rid of all this fire. Because whenever there's Lego fire, there we go, there's a kid. A refrigerator, perhaps. Nice, okay, so that is uh, kit number one of three in this area. So before we move on with anything else, I'm gonna try to move to a flying character. If we have one, I'll have to switch over to one because none of these characters can fly. Okay, not Clayface, but instead, uh, let's just do, uh, let's just do Black Adam. He's always just around, you know? And anything up this way? Not looking like it? Okay, good to know though. Can we fly? Okay, we cannot fly over them. Apparently the power of bullets is too strong for Black Adam. Can we get this? Yeah, let's beat this thing up before it's too late. There we go. So we're already doing pretty decent, 10,000 studs. What is down this way then? We just go behind these guys. Okay, I didn't know this was gonna be a whole new area. Always gotta be careful. As thorough as possible, looks like we have ourselves our picture perfect thing, which is good, because we were missing that. Let me beat these guys up while I have the chance then. Just go crazy on them. Um, we got a times three already, and I wanna keep that going up, so we just keep beating them up, that would be good. Black Adam, maybe you can help. Boom, times four now. Whoa, this guy with the with the shield, doing pretty well, isn't he? He's actually like tough to beat up right now. Can I not beat up the guys with the shields? I don't know, maybe it's not worth doing, because it's gonna ruin my multiplier if I take too long. Oh, here we go, here we go. Got him, times five, and 
Can I get you? Oh, 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 almost had the opportunity. Come on, no, no, no. This is not what I wanted to do. I wanted to beat this guy up. We got time six. Come on, we can do it, we can do it. Are these guys like undefeatable? <laughs> I don't know. Now we got times eight though. All the friends are coming over from the other side. Gotcha. We could easily get times 10 with this stuff then. Come on. Oh, there was more studs I could get here. Come on, get them. Perfect. Get back to this dude. These guys with the shields are like indef undefeatable. <laughs> it's weird. Come on, you can do better than this. I know you can. We got times nine. That's plenty enough to collect some studs. Get really up there with it all. Uh-oh. I'm not quite ready for this one. So Gordon, you get out of here. We're not getting through that door just yet. Wowee. Guess we have to do something in there. But that's not even what we're gonna worry about at the moment. <laughs> that police officer looks very worried. Come on, keep beating these guys up. We're at times 10 now. I don't think you can get any higher than times 10. So, oh look, there's a kid. There's a kid in that elevator. Got it. Oh, nice. <laughs> so there's quite a few going on here. Quite a lot of stuff, at the least. So I'm just trying to collect as many studs as possible. This is probably leading us to another thing right here with the little uh, magnifying glass. Probably our third kit, and if so, uh, our last kit for this area. Oh, the time stone is really helping out right now. We'll get these two blue studs. Got it, got it. Oh, that's almost a full stud meter right there. What about all this stuff? This is definitely something. True villain, awesome, so we don't have to worry about that anymore. So there's a couple things. First off, before we do too much more, I'll go ahead and grab another stud. I'm gonna fly this way and I'm going to switch to the Joker and we're going to spray paint over Professor Gordon. <laughs> Perfect. And uh, take photo. Yeah, beautiful. So there is that done. We got ourselves another picture perfect. And I'm gonna switch back over to Black Adam if I can, I cannot. So let's do it manually. Or anybody can fly really. Well, it doesn't seem like there's too many. Switch over to Black Adam for now and then we'll just try to get around as well as we can. But I need Zebra Man for this one. Zebra Man, where are you? Right here, because he can do telekinesis, and this might be our secret character. Or this is the red brick, I don't know. Can you guys get out of here? I'm gonna swing my tennis racket of doom. Of doom! Got it, okay. Back to this. Oh, this is the plant kinesis, or whatever. But yeah, this is, because there is the secret character in this area, right? Ooh, ooh, I need Cheetah for that. Do we have Cheetah? At least not out and about, so let's go ahead and switch over. That's her name, right? Yeah, Cheetah. So switch on over to her. I mean, maybe Clayface could have done this. I don't really know. Hold circle, I was doing that. Ah, there it is. A fascinating specimen. Almost worthy of my precious time and attention. Okay, so it looks like Riddler can do this, actually. Because I know the area here, we're supposed to be collecting everything for, like, Joker or something. I think Joker has to, like, collect all the things to put it in the can. Will you stop swinging at me? But there definitely is a secret character in this area that we're trying to find for right now. And this may be it. Ooh, under all these newspapers, huh? Let's find out. No, that's the pumpkin. Huh. Okay, so where in the world is the secret character part? Oh, I see the secret character. So I guess after this door, it's still sort of part of the first area, which is weird because we have found everything except for this. So it's weird that this is, you know, here. I guess that's something to do with this glass, right? Um. I don't know if I should switch to a character that can do this. Whoa, okay, that sort of worked. Okay, somebody can destroy this gold. Zebra Man can. Whoa, good for Zebra, Zebra Man. Okay, there we go. Uh, And then what else? Oh, here we go, here we go. Need somebody with electric powers. Well, I do have somebody. Well, actually, we should be. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. Not a selfie, not a monochrome selfie. It's not what I wanted. Yeah, our character should be as well. Oh, no, this isn't even an electrifying thing. We just gotta get tiny, okay. Got it. Well, we don't have to worry too much about these studs, so I may not. I mean, I guess they're in the way. I might as well get them. Whoop, hold on. Get over like that. Okay, this is not the work in the way I wanted it to. Perfect. Oh. And pull that switch. There we go. Maybe this is gonna unlock that secret character because we've gotten everything else in the first area. Okay, uh. Yes, it is, awesome. So, oh, is it Commissioner Gordon? It looks like it to me. So let's go ahead and switch over to our other character. Oh, it's, it's tiny little dude. Maybe you will. We yeah, a tiny little clay face running around. So that is it for the first area. So we'll move on to the second area and see what we can end up finding there. Okay, so here we are at this place. The, only the second out of two areas. So I'm guessing this is gonna be something. We need a strong character to break it. So where's Zebra Man? Do I not have Zebra Man out here? Get out of here. Uh, okay, 
Let's go ahead and get Zebraman out here then. Because Zebraman is super strong, so he should be able to do this no problem. Uh, tap circle. Oh, well, I didn't tap circle. But that's fine, I was able to make it work. So there is that four out of five, and then we're looking for the other brick. Or not the other, the red brick, and then the other mini kit. Which, hey, the mini kit's right here. So we need something like fire, I guess, to break this? Who has fire? I mean, our character does, right? I keep forgetting that. And then I don't know why our character's not on the quick select. You'd think out of all of them, that'd always be the case, but I suppose not. Um, for now, let's go ahead. I mean, maybe not. Maybe ice is broken with ice. Let's, no, no, that worked a little bit. Gosh darn it, I just switched away from that character. Cause I don't think any of these people, like maybe you do. It is weird how it offers characters that you can't actually, that aren't actually gonna be helpful for what you're trying to get done. You think it would all just like the characters you need for all the mini kits and stuff, but now, I don't know, it's weird. Anyways, go ahead and melt this again. Perfect. And this is mini kit five out of five, right? Perfect as well. So now all we're looking for is the red brick. Okay, so this is definitely something different up this way. Uh, some kind of glass related thing, which Batman, which was right there, should be able to break, right? Here, can we, there we go. I don't know what this is, some kind of fish. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Fish, but I had to do it. Ooh, now we're gonna be telekinetic. Who here is telekinetic? I don't know if any of these guys are. Uh, all right then, switch back to me. I'm just right up here. Telekinetic, ready, boom. And maybe, oh, yep, there we go. There, that is definitely pieces of a red brick. Look at that, boom, and there we go. We got the red brick. I don't know which red brick that is, but we're about to find out because we're gonna exit this level because as you can see, we have ourselves five kits, one secret character, which is Commissioner Gordon, one red brick, four golden bricks, one uh, picture perfect, and the true villain. So let's go ahead and exit this level, save and exit so that we can get all the stuff that we just did. That would stink if we didn't. <laughs> and as you can see, it's good to be bad. Skipped out on the Nightwing and the Batgirl boss fight, which is fine with me. So we don't need to see the tally up of the studs. We don't need to see, oh, there we go. All the kids, we get a picture of Batgirl, I guess is our Daily Planet uh, newspaper. We get paint splat footprints. That's a weird red brick. We've gotten some weird ones so far. The helium and the paint splat footprints. And of course, four out of four golden bricks. How awesome. And we already know that our secret character was Commissioner Gordon, so we should be able to skip this, no problem. Awesome stuff, so let's move on to level three, where hopefully we can make just as much progress. Okay, so now we're in the third level. I forget what it's called at the moment. It's, uh, it's stars in your eyes. Okay, um, so the first part has five kits and a red brick, this whole first section. And then the second section, which was the Beast Boy and Raven battle, which was really cool. That has a the uh, Joker picture and the hidden character. So we have a whole lot to find at this level, and I have to fill the stud meter. So I'm gonna get started with all of that now, and just like with the last of all, I'll keep you guys along with the ride with filling up the stud meter, because why not? That way, you know, if you guys are having a hard time with it, we can figure it out together. Hopefully we have a character that can break glass. I think that Cyborg can. Yeah, I think he can. I think that's sort of a part of this level, isn't it? Um, Or maybe not. Oh, the flash can, reverse flash. Okay, let's get to it. You got it, reverse flash. There we go, perfect. Yeah, because he was actively in this level previously, gotcha. Pick up those stuff, just try to break whatever thing we really can. If I switch over to my character, they should be able to bust this thing open, which I don't remember which things are and are, are not part of the kit, so we're just gonna try to explore what we can. And if I see anything that I think will trigger the next part of the level, I'll try to avoid it. And just try to get whatever studs we can for now. So which character can light things up? Can you, Oh, you can go like infrared vision, that's so cool, Cyborg. And what does that do? Oh, is that like a punching thing? Guess we gotta punch that, and that one, and that one. And don't forget that one. Lastly, we got one over here. There's gonna be five of them. That seems like a very Lego thing. Yes, it is, okay, cool. So we, we got a timer though. So we gotta punch all of them as quickly as possible. Probably wanna switch over to the flash for that then. Two out of five. Oh gosh, we're running out of time real fast. Uh, three out of five. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Four to five. Wait, I ran out of time, really? Oh, that was really fast. Uh-oh, let's try that again. Do I have to, uh, right here, tap circle, no? Ah, oh, well, I guess I have to do that part of Cyborg. That's sort of a shame. It's really tough to do in that amount of time. Okay, that time it worked. Punch it, there we go, good, good, good. Get over to this one. I'm actually gonna shortcut to this one because it just seems to be a smarter idea. 
Got it, and then run over and boom. See, that was actually a tough one. But we did all five of them, which should get us a kit, right? Oh, even better, we get the red brick. No wonder that was tough. Okay. Oh, and we picked up a purple stud there too. Yet more proof that only Ooh. I deserve to be the one true speedster. <laughs> because he's the reverse flash. Very cool, so we got ourselves a red brick and we got plenty of other things to explore because there are five kits in the first area, which I mean, this might not be the only part of the first area, there might be more after this, but need to make sure we're exploring this stuff as much as possible for now. Uh, and so far we're doing pretty well. I mean, we're building up our stud meter, which is another big thing. The flash is pretty good for beating things up and collecting things just because he moves around so fast. There isn't too much over this way at all. Ooh, here's a kid chilling out. So, no, actually, I need to be reverse flash for it. What am I doing? So it's just gonna go ahead and boom, bust it, and get kit number one. That only I deserve to be the it, one you just said best. that. I, I get it, I get it, but you just said it. Okay, get as many studs as we can from all this stuff. Boom, bust it. We're doing really good with that, actually. I like it. And what about up this way? Looks like we have you guys, all this stuff. Got some books, got some other, like, shelves and stuff, and we're already at like 30, almost 40,000 studs, so we're doing some pretty good work with it. It's probably gonna be like 150,000 studs for everything. What is this about? Uh, oh, yeah, Zebra Man can do it. Good old Zebra Man, where are ya? He can do the plant talking. Oh, so what did that do? Whoa, it did that! And that leads up there where there's some electric thing going on. Which once again, our character might be able to do. We do. We have heat and electricity already. Got it. And tap. Oh no, it's a tiny thing again. I always forget that. Anyways, let us go ahead and definitely pick up as many studs as we can for this one because we are trying to fill up that stud meter. That was pretty good. Oh, jump through like the ow. That hurt. That's fine. That's fine. It happens. Go down this way. Got those as well. 44,000 studs right now. I can't wait until we get some stud multipliers. Maybe the one we just got will finally be one. But I guess we'll find out sooner or later. We That has to be a kit somewhere, right? Uh, Yeah, kit, awesome. So there is a kit number two out of five, which we're looking for all five of them. Oh, there's a purple stud. Yeah, good purple stud right there. I like it, we're making some great progress so far. I think I did see a blue stud back this way. Indeed I did. We can't bust any of this stuff, nope. Oh, we got plenty of, wait, there's just a kid hanging out right behind there, that's a, that's a sneaky one. So there's a three out of five now, how crazy is that? So I can't destroy all this computer stuff, but it still gives me studs for hitting it, so you better bet I'm gonna hit it as much as we can. So it shows you, you know, not every kid is about exploding things. Some of them are just hot, hidden in the environment, but uh, Gotta keep going, gotta keep going. We're at 60,000 studs now, making some great progress. Is there any kind of like hidden stud back here? You would think there'd be like a purple stud, but no. Hmm. Got a blue stud back on this side. And it looks like that's just about everything we can break. Oh, no, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> There's never, never everything we've broken or can break broken. That's for sure. Okay, I got that. Keep moving through everything. Man, we've like, destroyed a lot of stuff though, you know? I don't know how much more we can. I mean, we can bust on that thing a little bit and then somebody can interact with the computer cyborg. So I think this is probably just another room. I don't think this is a mini kit. Oh, I sort of, oh, I do remember this, okay. So yeah, let me figure this out real fast. So this is something, I don't really remember what. Oh, it's a ladder up this way. Okay, so there's plenty more to do up here. Uh, something Cyborg can investigate, apparently. I don't know why it was telling us to do that here. Oh, oh, this thing up here. Okay, I need to be Batman, which I don't know if we have Batman on our quick select right now. Well, we're huge. Not what I meant to do. Batman, yeah, okay. Switching over to Batman, who can be like, oh yes, my batarangs, throw them. Urgh, I'm Batman. And hey, look at that, Perhaps kid number four. Clue. It is another clue about how that we're progressing through things. So where in the world is the fifth and final one? I gotta look around a little bit more. Here, let's glide across to here, perfect. I think we're supposed to be a different character that can glide across there, but you know what, Batman works just fine. So what's going on with this area? Ooh, we can destroy some gold. Maybe just switch over to Cyborg to do that. Anything else though? There is this computer. Uh, which doesn't really do much, okay. 
Switch to Cyborg. Hold on, Cyborg was right there. I mean, I guess I could have done it too. What is this about then? I mean, I think this is, I don't know if this is something we normally do. I don't think so. So let's go ahead and break it open and what do we got inside? A couple of studs. Ooh, a silver thing to break. Uh, is Batman, I don't think Batman's on our quick select either though. Oh, Cyborg can definitely break it, right? Pretty sure he can. No, he can't break silver stuff? Okay, you know who can though is the Joker. The Joker can break silver stuff real easy. So, let's uh, no, 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 Joker, come on. What are you doing? It won't work. There it goes, right? Why, why is he not throwing the, the thing on the silver? What? Excuse me. Okay, that time it worked. It was very picky about it. Whoa, what is this doing? Everything's breaking. Oh my gosh. Ah! He didn't like that very much. Was that what I was supposed to do? Oh, that broke all this. Okay, that might have been what I was supposed to do. I don't remember. <laughs> and then there's some like flash guys. Yeah, okay, so that was what we were supposed to do the whole time. And I thought we were doing something special. I was wrong. Okay, so where's Cyborg? Because he can fly, yeah. Is there anything else to get around here with this stuff? I suppose not. Whoa, 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 camera. Oh, hey, look, something gold. That might be what we're looking for up there. That is weird. I would have never noticed that if the camera wasn't doing what it was doing, which is probably why I did it. So let's try that out real fast. Can you leave me alone? Okay, you can't. Okay, well, geez, what a jerk. Get out of here right now. Can I beat these guys? Are these guys even beatable? I don't remember. All I want to do is bust this thing. Got it, okay. I missed out on some studs there, but that's fine, I don't care. Oh, and here's the kid. Okay, kid five out of five. Another job well done by the half man, half machine, all hero, cyborg. Yeah, you're really good at complimenting yourself. Okay, so I, I just need to figure everything else out then. Okay, so here we are at this section, which I think that, I don't really remember too much. I know we have to fight, Be fight Beast Boy and stuff. Can I like skip out of this battle and just like focus on other stuff? I don't think so. I think I have to beat Beast Boy first and then I can worry about sort of the free roam part of this level. I can only hope, right? So I'm just gonna beat you up as fast as I possibly can. Right now it's the Flash versus Beast Boy, which isn't quite right, but hey, we'll do it. Okay, whoa, jump out of that. Thank you. We're doing pretty well so far. Oh gosh, watch out. Watch out, keep fighting him, keep fighting him. This is turning out pretty well though. I think we're fighting him and like beating him up. Okay, a little bit better than we did the first time around. Let me pick up my studs again. We're so close to the full stud beaner. I'm sure we're gonna be able to get it in a moment. Come on, get, ow, rude, rude. Okay, here we go. So we're looking for a picture, which is, you know, like where the thingamajig is. The, um, what is it called? Uh, the, the picture perfect when we're able to spray paint and everything. And then we're also looking for the hidden character, wherever that may be. Oh, here we go. So let's switch over to the Joker super duper fast, which I don't have him on my quick select. Great. Joker and Zebraman, the two ones I need all the time. I mean, this time I did the, the Zebraman, but it's not Joker. Okay, so perfect. This is the other thing we need to complete, and then we just gotta find that secret character somewhere. Wherever that might be, and also the full stun meter. Got it. Okay, that was sort of a bad photo. He's in the middle of blinking, but who cares? Okay, let's look for a stun meter going on here as quickly as I can as well. I think it's just gonna be 100,000 studs. Maybe it could be a little bit more, but if we just keep beating stuff up, we'll get it soon enough, right? That'd be good. Here, Beast Boy, I don't know who he's fighting right now, but he's fighting somebody, all right. Okay, whoa, we're getting lots of studs for this stuff right now. Got it. Lots of electricity happening around here. I'll probably just get a character who can fly and fly up. Where is uh, Captain Cold or whatever his name is? Is he not a part of the selection right now? Hold on. Character grid. I know, I want to switch characters. It just all my characters are like transforming when I want to change them. There we go. Okay, ooh, look at all this stuff. Nice lot of studs over here. What's going on down this way? Nothing. <laughs> That's a little weird. Uh, okay. And there's plenty around this area I have not explored, as you can see. A lot of this, you know, I just sort of focused on the fight, which is what I should have been doing. So, you know, I don't have a problem with it. I don't think I can get up that way, really, so I think that's about it for this lower floor. So let me move back that way and try to get up. I mean, I don't even need the mirror or the reflection too much. I just need to switch over to a black Adam and fly around like that. And let's take a look at everything from up here. Like, this is, oh, that's the extra, like, ability for Zebra Man. This is, there's lots of stuff going on here. Ooh, 
Yeah, something maybe with that? I don't know, there's lots of stuff going on. Ooh, or maybe this? I do not remember this at all, so this could be something. Let me destroy all this stuff. We're so close to the full stud meter. I really need to focus on that. Boom, got more blue studs. Almost there, come on. Has to be 110,000, has to be. Come on, get that again. No way to break this thing? Like all the way, there it is, true villain. Okay, never have to worry about this again. Back to Zebra Man, hold circle, and bust this thing. Maybe we've done this before, really hard to tell. Come on now. Ooh, almost, and got it. Oh, oh yeah, this is new. Okay, so we got a secret character going on here. And tons of blue studs, I could have just done this. <laughs> Had to make sure though. So I can press this button. Ooh, okay, that makes sense. So I need to switch over to Mirror Man. He's not in my selection at the moment. But he is, where on the character select? Maybe if I go close to here, it'll sort of be yeah, a Mirror Master. If you go close to something, it'll probably, like it usually auto brings you to whatever you need. Just not always, so we gotta do that. Press this button. Haha, so funny. And there we go, we get some kind of flash for that. And that should mean that this level is 100% complete. If we take a look, we've gotten all five kits. The secret character, red brick, four gold bricks, the picture perfect, and the stud meter. So we are good to exit this level, save and exit. How awesome is that? Very, very good. And as you can see, the Daily Planet stars in your eyes. Very cool. Uh, so with this one, we can we can skip that. We have 2.6 million studs, and all five kits where we get a picture of Raven. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And uh, what's going on with this one? We got the big head mode. Still not a stun multiplier. Is there no stun multiplier in this game, or they just really make it hard to get? I don't know, I guess we'll find out. And then we get, of course, all four of the golden bricks for getting the full set of mini kits, all of the stud multipliers, like everything. So very, very cool, we get all of this going on, but what was our secret character? I'm super excited to see. Oh, we got a vehicle for that even? It was, it was some kind of flash, I didn't read that, sort of popped up real fast. We'll check it out once we get back to the overworld, but there we go, let's head on to level number four. All right, so for level four, Harley and the Ivy, we have two areas. We have one with two kits, and then an area with three kits, picture perfect, red brick, and secret character. Luckily, we've already got the stud meter for the, this one, so we're just gonna keep finding different kits and see how everything turns out. Oh, that was one out of five right there. So it looks like pulling on these little flowers. I think there was another one somewhere around here. Seems to do something for us. Or was there not another one around here? I thought there was. Hmm, I'll to try to keep looking for those, but it looks like that's at least one thing we can do is out of five, we can pull those little flowers wherever I find them. Um, but that's the first of two things in this first area for sure. So gotta keep finding more kits. Okay, so it does look like in the second part of this battle there are more. I've been looking at all over the place. I haven't really found anything more. I mean, I know this first part is only supposed to have two kits, but it feels pretty barren. I mean, I guess it's mostly just focused on the boss fight, but uh, right now I do see this one right here. Go ahead and just tap the circle button a bunch, and that is two out of five. And it looked like in that little scene you could see another one over this way. Maybe not, hard to tell. Might have to like beat up some other stuff first. So who out of, no, no selfies. No selfies. <laughs> don't have anything against selfies, I'm just, I'm busy. Can I destroy this from here? I don't know what's going on right now. Can deal with this. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. <laughs> just had to sneak behind here and boom. That should be three out of five. Really hard to tell from this angle. Okay, so it looks like we got our last two flowers over this way as we're almost defeated Poison Ivy. I don't want to defeat her just yet. I want to focus on this if I can. So as soon as it gives me the option to change characters, I want to change to Batman again. And no, 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 let's just get close enough to do this, right? Tap circle. Oh, wait, wait, hey, stop throwing mushrooms. Stop throwing mushrooms at me. So rude. I know, it does. So be prepared for mushrooms to be thrown at you. And then pull this down. Perfect, four out of five. Run over this way and there we go. This should be our first kit of the level and our first of two for this area. This so what is our Why? next thing? Oh, maybe something with this. Oh, I do see it. I do see something, right? There's something glowing back there. I need mind control though. Does Riddler do mind control? Sinestro definitely doesn't. I guess he, wait, no, tap circle. I guess he does. Oh, and there we go, instantly got it. I'm sure I can find a good use for it. Well, you did. So there are the first two kits for this area, the only things for this area, so I guess we're just gonna move on to the second area and get some things going on there. 
<laughs> Why are we giant? Who knows? <laughs> that was weird. Anyways, we're in the second area now where hopefully we can get some more stuff done at this checkpoint. I'm probably just gonna switch to a flying character. Who was that yellow person we had? Poison Ivy just knew 52. Cool, I like it. Uh, we'll just switch over to somebody who can fly real fast. Uh, usually we'll just do uh, Black Adam because he's just one of the easiest ones to select. I know where he is exactly on the, on the character select wheel. I'm just trying to remember which things were actually available and which things weren't. Definitely this Batarang thing wasn't available because we got a lot to find. A red brick, secret character thing, like everything else except for those two mini kits. So definitely have our work ahead of us. But what did that do? Uh, something with, oh, I do see a bunch of studs. A ton of studs. And what else? Was that it, just studs? Uh, I mean, I guess that was cool, but not really what I was looking for, weird. Uh. I'll keep looking and find what else we can do around here. Me, once again, no, no, Black Adam's right here. Switch back to him and just sort of fly around, see what we can get done. In this area, like this is an area we could have reached one way or another, I think. I don't know what that does. We're about to find out. Yeah, this will just like open this door or something. Okay, gotcha. Well, we don't have to worry about that very much. We, we, we have that handled. Can't go like over this way? Not really, no, okay. Oh, I do see this. This is definitely something. Uh, so Batman, you do your Batman thing. It looks like a computer thing, cool. Some kind of satellite. This has to be a kit or something. Doesn't seem like a red brick kind of thing, so I'm gonna assume it isn't. Yeah, it just looks like this. Okay, cool, we can do that. And that seems to be, like I've been looking through this area, can't find too much more. I mean, this area is quite long. It's only a two part area, so or two part level, which usually means some of the areas can be a little bit long going. And I think that's the case with this one. Got some bad guys, they're not bad guys, they're police, they're not bad guys, we're the bad guys, remember? I just, I'm, I'm playing Batman, so I got it mixed up. Okay, so I'll keep looking for another kit, or whatever else I might be able to find. Okay, so the second floor up this way, there's definitely some stuff going on. Ooh, I, I think I, can I not get in here? Oh, this is weird. It doesn't let me, th oh, is this a glass? Okay, never mind. Then there has to be a way, here we go. Okay, this makes a bit more sense. He can do it, I don't know who this guy is. But apparently he has his own spray capabilities. Cool, I'll take it. So what, yeah, who is this guy? I mean, some flame dude. Yeah, like heat wave or something. Weird that he can do it. <laughs> uh, but there's a lot going on in this area, we know, we know. But what we're looking for is that area up that way. Come on, it's taking too long. <laughs> Ready, oh, and there's two of us, weird. I can switch over to Superwoman down this way because she's not too far away and she can fly, right? Yep, she can. So then I can switch back to him, weirdly enough, and just spray over this. This is one of the first times we're doing this is not Joker. Selfie. So there we go, we got that one done, pretty cool. Which means we got ourselves the picture perfect, which means we're still looking for quite a lot though. I don't know if any of it is up this way. Who can destroy glass that we might have? Batman can. No, tap circle, no, tap, there you go. Okay, so it looks like this got us something. This might be, oh, it's a kit. Perhaps Boom, kit four out of five, awesome. So I don't know where else in the world we might be heading to, but I'm gonna keep looking. Okay, so we're at this little party and I already see something with telekinesis we can do over this way. I don't think any of, oh wait, yeah, of course Zebra Man does. Ow, ow, rude, rude, get out of here, be gone. <laughs> wow, we just brought him into the ground when there was no ground, we're on solid carpet. <laughs> Okay, hey, I wasn't done. Hold on, leave me alone. Perfect, what did that get us? Ooh, secret character. Out of the way, there we go, perfect. So let me switch back to the Green Lantern, who can fly around very helpfully. What else can we find around this way? Uh, Maybe something on the sides or something, or maybe up here. Oh, look at this, what is this then? Some kind of weird just statue. Who can destroy silver? Batman can. Ooh, what is this? Oh, it's fallen. <laughs> Yikes, watch out below. That could have hurt somebody. So what is this about then? Maybe it's our last kit, that would be awesome. Gotta find out. And then there's something with Clayface over this way that I don't think anybody has done yet. But first off, whoa, whoa, Batman, put the police officer down. Wait, what is this about? I don't know, this is something different. I think this is for the main area, telling us what to do. I already know what to do, and it ain't that. <laughs> okay, we get it, we get it. So we need somebody to be on top of this. It might have to be like a Green Lantern. Yeah, okay. So let's uh, switch back over to him and hold circle. Oh, look at this, we're making a fountain. 
And the fountain spits out a red brick, awesome! So which red brick will this be? I'm not sure, but this is our fourth one in total, which is awesome, and I got it. This day hasn't been all bad. Yeah, I guess not. Then what is this about? Uh, I think this is actually something, yeah, this is, uh, can Poison Ivy go down the, one of these? I think she can. No, she can't. Well, Zebra Man can. Here, I think. Tap circle. So we've probably, yeah, we've already done this one. Okay, never mind. Gotta find that last kit somewhere. Oh, what is this? I swear this wasn't here before. Weird, okay, uh, did this pop up? Are you, can you dig this or no? You're acting like you can, and then, oh, there it goes, it just took a second. Oh, it's the kit! Hold on, I'm not done. Oh, come on, come on, you got it! Yeah, that's true. Okay, so if we take a look, that is all five kits, the secret character, the red brick, the four golden bricks, and the picture thing, and of course, all of the other stuff. So very, very cool. Let's get out of here. I am so glad to finally get that one done. That one took a good chunk of work, but as you can see, the Daily Planet, the Harley, and the Ivy is completed, and along with it, we have gotten ourselves, you know, more studs, blah, 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 and uh, the full stud meter, which is Poison Ivy. Awesome. Whatever that was, it was all the kits. That's what it was. Uh, collects guide studs, that's good. Um, I guess, I mean, it's not the craziest thing in the world to get collect side, or yeah, guide studs, not side guns. Um, it, but it's not anything crazy. So who is our secret character? It's Jinx, I don't know anything about Jinx, but she looks pretty cool. Awesome stuff, so there is level four done, which means we have one left to do in this episode. Let's get to it. Okay, so level number five is Arkham Barely Believe It, and as you can see, there are three separate sections, one with too many kits, the second with too many kits, the picture perfect, and the secret character, and then the third one with one more mini kit and one more red brick, and all throughout it, I have to get the full stud meter, so let's get started. All right, so let's get started with all of this. Make sure we're breaking as much stuff as physically possible. I think I already see a kit in the background. That will be awesome to see. Uh, and we only need to find two, so like really beyond that, our goal is just to collect as many studs as I physically, physically can, I don't know what this golden thing is right here. This has to be something. Uh, let's bust it and find out. Uh, I mean, it gave me studs, but nothing of interest, really weird. Usually you don't find something like that without it giving some kind of specific benefit. There's another one. And maybe these are just to give me studs, or maybe not. What is this thing? I have no clue. Uh, but I saw a purple stud beyond that door, so that'll be pretty cool. Let's go ahead and go. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Plenty more stuff, ready, boom, got it. Boom, got it again. One more time, there we go. <laughs> so I'm just trying to break all this stuff before we head up there, because I'm sure that, that'll be interesting. I wonder if we can ever get our character to start flying. I don't know if that is something, I haven't really bothered with it too much, but that would make a lot of stuff a whole bunch easier if our character could just fly. Whoa! Oh, hey, yeah, that's right, we got a uh, Superman Luther. So what is going on with this? It looks like, I might want to switch back to my character, because we have ourselves an electricity thing. Finally, it's actually an electricity thing and not the, the shrinking area. But we have some extra studs in here. Okay, but that's it? That is sort of weird. It just gives you studs. I mean, I'll take them gladly, but not a kit of any fashion. Weird stuff. And can I bust any of this? Uh, it looks like I can, which means I will. Okay, got that. Let's work on this side as well. Come on, perfect, and boom. That seems to be about everything. 44,000 studs and we're only two little blips into the stud meter. That is a little concerning, but we'll just keep working and keep trying to find stuff and hopefully we'll do fine. Luckily, our tennis racket slam is actually quite the reliable thing, so I like it. And then I don't know if someone can, oh, okay, Lex. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that was silly. <laughs> Whoopsies. Uh, can you just throw that over that way and then we'll switch back over to Lex if we can. Perfect. Okay, got it. So I don't really have to worry about icing that stuff up. I mean, I probably should go check out the one place where I do know there's a kit, but I'm just trying to take it the long way around so we can get as many studs as possible. Probably should beat these guys up then. Beat up bad guys, get the stud multiplier. That's what we did in the second level and it turned out pretty well. So I don't know how long this episode is gonna be for you guys, but it's taken me about two hours to record it all. So hopefully it's been a nice, fun video for you guys so far, because it takes a lot of work to do all this stuff. Also, I'd rather him not be stuck but I sort of wish I could have saved that purple stud for when we had a stud multiplier like we do right now. Sort of a shame to miss out on that, but hey, I did what I could. We're at 89,000 studs right now. 
And uh, if I find any cool purple studs just chilling about in the environment, I might leave them for if we get another multiplier. But at this point, I'm not really sure if we will. Hmm. But we're clearing out this area pretty well. Let me go ahead and fly over this way now. I know there's some stuff we can break over this way. What I'm mostly focused on is this. Uh, oh, it looks like we can do something with a Batarang up there. I see that. Okay, got all those guys. All those guys were only at times two? Probably because I got them, got rid of a bunch of them with just a slam. That's sort of a, a shame. How to use this. Uh, okay, Lex Luthor not having time to learn? Isn't he supposed to be super smart? Well, luckily, Batman does. So let's go ahead and throw that Batarang, just like that. And that should stop this water spraying on the ice. And there's another purple stud in there. Gosh darn it, I missed out on it again. Oh uh, well, that's fine. Uh, I can switch over to me, Zebra Man, and then just melt this away. Perfect. I think we'll be able to get the full stud meter, no problem. But there we go, this is our first kid of the level. Took a lot of work, but it was well worth it. One out of five. Can we break this stuff? Oh, you bet we can. Tons of stud out of that. Got it, okay, so I don't know where the next uh, mini kit is, but it should be somewhere in the same area, so I'll be looking for it. But in the meantime, we got plenty of this other stuff to break open. I'm gonna take full advantage, because I can really use the studs. Ooh, come on now, that worked out pretty well. Try that again. Oh, something broke there, but didn't quite get where I wanted it to. Okay, grabbing some of this stuff. And I know some of this is just to progress with the level. Like this glass, I'm pretty sure, is something I gotta use to progress for the level. We'll try it out in a moment with like the flash or something, just breaking it. But for right now, if I, if I can do this, I'm gonna do this. I know it's a little slow, but it's sort of our best bet with everything. Okay, got it, very good. And then break this computer. We're about halfway through our stud meter. I mean, this is a three-part level as well, so we're definitely gonna get it. Okay, so like as you can see, it's not really telling me who can break it, but I still think we can. We move over to reverse flash. I should be able to deal with this. No, you can't. And then boom. And that worked. Oh, maybe this is it then. I don't really know. Uh okay, let's switch over to live wire. I don't know if we would have live wire in this level normally. I don't think so. But hey, we can hop in. Ooh, plenty of studs to get in here as well, so that makes it pretty pretty good. Pretty good indeed. Gonna pick up all this stuff. Awesome. Ow, we got hurt there a little bit, that's fine. We'll be okay. And now we're just about halfway through the stud meter, so we're making some progress. That is not the way I wanted. Go this way, and boom, got it. So there is that done. I don't know what that'll do for us, if that is the uh, mini kit or not, or will that just open this door? That'll just open this door, which I think is what we need to progress for farther anyways, but I hope it doesn't force us forward, because that would be a problem. Uh, the door's gonna open. I just won't go that way for right now. Yeah, okay, bring me back this way, good. So I'm just gonna leave it, and I wanna keep trying to find that second kit. What is going on up here? I don't know if we can normally get up this way. Tons of stuff to break, though, so it's pretty fun. There's definitely more to explore up this way, so we'll find our way around and just sort of see what ends up working out for us, but for now, I'm gonna just break these printers. <laughs> oh gosh, usually printers don't work anyways, right? So. Who cares? And what about this stuff? I don't remember this stuff at all, so it must be related to the kit. Like, I really don't remember any of this. Okay, break this thing as well, and it looks like there's something to build. You have to get to a good angle. Oh, this is gonna start whatever this thing is. Okay, sure. Um, Was that good? I mean, maybe this is something? Oh, they know what, I guess so. This is something we've, we could have already done. Yeah, we take the elevator up there or something. I don't know why I don't remember any of this. You'd think I'd remember some of it at the least, but we can break those guys out if I wanted to. But I do not, I'm gonna fly past them. Hmm, oh, I can't get past that. Okay, oh, I do see another purple stud. I would love to grab that awesome purple stud right there. So who can turn invisible? Batman can? I guess he can, look at him. Um, And then somebody needs to be able to do this. This is another small one, so Zebra Man should be able to hop in. Let's figure this out. It might not be what I'm looking for still, but at this point, I'm a little clueless. At the least, you know, we're making some great progress for our stud meter, you know? And that's equally as important as everything else. Here, get up there. Can you not do it? There you go, good job. Oh gosh, we're getting beat up. 
Keep going, keep going. Huh? Gotta tilt it this way, tilt it back this way, pick up a couple more studs, and boom! So that busted that one. I say the word busted a lot in today's episode. I'll try not to. <laughs> I'm getting sick of saying it too. So, that opens this door. Which this door seems different. I don't know if we've opened this one before. It, it's the exact same door, it explodes the exact same way, but it's over on this side. And whatever this thing is, um, there's some kind of lever. Uh, whoa, whoa, what is that? Giant box. Whoa, giant plant. What is going on with this? He does not look very happy. Okay, he's spitting out a ton of studs. Holy cow. Okay, and he's gone. <laughs> Going to go join the Smash Brothers roster. Okay, let's pick up all these studs real fast. Oh my gosh, that was insane. And we get ourselves a second kit, so that is everything for this area. Now I just gotta find my way into the next area. Okay, so we're in the second area where there are two more kits, a picture and a character. Okay. Hmm, okay, I'm just checking to make sure everything's turning out okay with that. So, one thing I did notice is that over this way, we do have this, which I feel like we've gone down here before. I don't know if any of our characters can. Let me try to get rid of some of these good guys first. I mean, Zebra Man should be able to just go small and go through here, so I probably already have. Whoa. No, no, it's not. <laughs> okay, so I got a purple stud for that. Oh, there's a little duck. Okay, who can explode silver? I think Lex can one out of five. Gotcha, so that's probably what we're looking for then. And we still have a little bit more studs to go. Yeah, actually we have a lot more studs to go. <laughs> Not a little bit. I'll keep trying to get them though. So yeah, we'll try to find two kits and the picture. The picture should be the easiest thing, right? The hidden character, I'm not too sure about. Uh, sometimes this can be really tricky and sometimes they're not tricky at all. You know, it's sort of this weird in the middle. Maybe we need like 250,000 studs for this full stud meter, hard to tell. But it looks like that's about it for that. I might just leave Lex down there. Hmm. So I'm guessing, yeah, whatever we need for this, uh, that's gonna be whatever we can fill the canister with, which the canister is over this way, which is normally what we use Joker for. So I know what to avoid to continue this area, because I don't want to continue it at the moment. Got it. Go ahead and beat this person up. They are all over the place right now. I don't appreciate it. What about this one? I don't know if these guys like just indefinitely keep popping up. I sure hope not. Do we have, yeah, we do have a frozen character, so we can work on this stuff. First off, get rid of you. Thank you. And then keep blasting. What in the world's going on with this thing? Was that anything? Oh, it was a piece for Joker. Okay, I gotcha. Speaking of which, do we have Joker? We do, so let's go ahead and have him destroy some silver stuff, and that's probably just gonna be another piece for his thing. Yep, it's gonna be the chicken. So I'm just gonna ignore the canister itself, and we should be okay. Shouldn't be that big of a problem. But we can get a lot of studs out of this, so pretty cool. Oh, there was a frozen dude. Get out of here, I'm done with you. Uh, so I can blast this stuff, but I really don't think it's gonna do too much for me. I and mean, there's something in there for the Joker. Oh, I do see the secret character, actually. Huh. Okay. So let's try that out. Hold on. Beat you up. See ya. Because a Joker can make his chattery teeth happen. Which is pretty good. So Joker, send those in. And wait, wait, that's not where I thought it was gonna bring me. <laughs> wait, that's weird. I thought it was gonna go on the other side of that wall, but apparently not. What in the world, and how do we get in there? We may find out pretty soon, but at the same time, I'm not really sure. Weird. How did Lex get back down there? He was up here a moment ago. Unless we have another Lex up here. We do. <laughs> there's two Lex Luthers running around right now. Okay, there's another trumpet piece or something. That's not what I'm caring about right now. How do we get into this room? I don't know. Oh, mind control, duh, where's the Riddler? Riddler, where are you? Here you are. No, wait, tap circle. There we go, see, look at this. Makes so much sense. So it looks like we have the guide over this way. We need to, or sort of, um. What loser put this here and why can't I use it? Okay, so, looks like we have ourselves a bit of a puzzle between the two chalkboards on our left and the right. So this one's gonna be purple, this one's gonna be uh, purple as well. Got it, and there we go, there's a secret character. Again, How cool is that? Prince of Conundrums is successful in his endeavors. So that's one last thing to worry about. I wanna switch to a character that can fly, so where's Lex at? He is right here. 
I want to get up this way, because I did see quite a lot of action going on, or only uh, a purple stud, which is, you know, a lot of action for us when we're so close to getting the stud meter. There we go, perfect. We're getting so close to it now. More to break with this thing, though, so don't want to go just yet. And what's going on up here? Now, this is definitely an area I don't think we're normally at. I mean, maybe it actually is. The cabinets seem a little bit familiar. So we're just gonna beat everything up. But we got the one character, so two kits and the the picture. Whatever that might be. Oh, there's the other Lax. Hi, other Lax. How are you doing? He's like, what are you doing, other me? Are you doing something evil? Like I would expect you to do, because I am also evil. Yeah, I do remember having to th build that, so I'm gonna leave that, or maybe I should just build it. See what's going on with that. Oh yeah, this is like a super speed section for the Flash that I won't do just yet. I'll leave it be, and we'll figure it out later. Instead, I'll go this way. Ooh, and there's another silver duck to explode. How many of these do we gotta get? Oh wait, two out of five, that's three out of five. So it's not just silver ducks, it's just silver things. So there should be two more around here to destroy. Okay. Hmm. Moving this way, whoa, whoa, okay. Didn't even know this was an area. Can I just, I can pull this down, what is this? Some kind of generator? Ooh. And then somebody can go down that way where there is a kit and the thing. Awesome, that'll be cool. So I just need to switch over to True Villain, we did it! Finally, it was 250,000 studs. That is a lot of studs compared to some of the other levels. That is just crazy to get all that. Okay, so now that we're in here, we need to get this kit, we need to switch over to Joker, and do this, I don't know who that is, but we're covering her up. Cool, and once get, we're gonna go ahead and take a selfie, perfect. And there we have it. So now at this point, we've got the secret character, we got the picture, all we're looking for now is the fourth kit somewhere around here. So I've looked everywhere and I have no clue. So hopefully doing this won't force us to the next area because if not, like I don't really know what else to do. I've looked all around. I mean, I guess I could do the flash thing. That might be something. So maybe I shouldn't have done this just yet. Uh, so let's go actually then. I'll switch back over to you. And, hmm. Wait, wait no, no, I need, yeah, Lex. Darn it. Uh, Lex Luthor, right here. So let's try the flash thing. I don't entirely remember what this is then. So we'll find out together. Maybe it's something worthwhile, maybe it's not. Oh, he was right there and I messed it up. He is right here. So we'll go as fast as we can into whatever realm this will do. I don't think this is it though, because we're trying to look for the other silver stuff, right? Unless like the other silver stuff is in another portion of the level, you know? But I have no clue. Got it. Okay, so far so good. Uh, got that one. And I don't have to worry about getting any studs or anything. I'm just trying to get the pieces. So five out of 10, six, uh, seven, eight, two more, two more. Oh, how was that, how was that, how did I not get that one? Nine and 10, awesome. So what does that do for us? Wow, we, what in the world is this thing? I have no clue, but it's gotta be good, right? Uh, it needs electricity power. We can do that. Oh, there I was, and I messed it up. Okay, get rid of this guy as well, or girl, sorry. Uh, no, hold square it was, or hold hold circle? Hold square, gotcha. What is this? I don't remember this one either. But it must be something good. Oh boy. Oh, is it just gonna blast this debris out of the way? I suppose so? I mean, oh, it's going haywire. Huh. Okay, now it's blasting this door open. Oh, there's the exit. Weird. I mean, I don't want to take the exit just yet then, because I'm still looking for two silver things. Where could they be? Oh, here they are. Okay, so when we're trying to go get Solomon Grundy, this is where it's all going on. So, yeah, we just had to use a Joker thing for this. That makes a lot of sense, so I'm just gonna switch over real quick to, um, here he is. Blast that thing. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. Right? Hold on, what's going on here? He's not doing his actual blast. There it is, four to five, and then five out of five. The prize I've been looking for. So that is everything we needed for this area, so I'm gonna move on to the next one through this door, and we should be good to go. All right, so we got this part with the giant monster man. I don't like it very much. So I'm gonna try to figure everything out here, because in this one we're looking for one kit and one red brick, that's all. So 
Just gotta be very selective with what we're doing as we run around and just try to be sure we don't accidentally progress through the level. Can't go through there, the door's just closed. That's just a blue stud. And uh, I don't know what that is. Okay, oh, oh, he's mad, he's mad. Oh, here we go. Hold on, there's something golden here. Leave me alone, leave me alone, you big dude. Let me try to bust this, I don't know if I can as this. Okay, he can't get me when I'm in there. Unfortunately, the, the steam blocked me off. Am I not allowed in there yet? Or is it just like a matter of timing? Okay, there goes the steam. And then, go for it. Gotcha, okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to do whatever I can with this. I don't know if we can melt this as Lex. Oh, it's working. And then we gotta go through there. Which, uh, Clayface could have done. But I can do too, yeah! What is in here? This is a whole new room for me. Uh, ooh. Oh, we need some some of the Joker bad guys, don't we? Okay. Then one is this way. Okay, so we got ourselves, can can Lex do this with the super suit? He can. What is this about? I, yeah. That sort of worked, it sort of did not. A big button, press the button. Good job, Lex, you're the best. Ooh, uh, a bunch of pieces. Oh, there are all the guys. Okay, we can do that. No problem out. So I just gotta fly up there real fast and get to building. I don't know what this is. An electricity thing? Or is it one of the, the, the things where we need to be oh. small? Yeah, okay. We got it. Clayface should be able to do that. Just hop on in. And since we already got the stud meter, I'm not too worried about getting the studs for this. Just trying to get through it as fast as I can, to be honest with you. Whoop, got it, ow, we got zapped. Keep moving, keep moving. Okay, and let this fall like that, and punch it. Punch it, you got it. There it is. So this will unleash the four Joker guys, and maybe either give us the kid or give us the red brick, one of those two. So let me move over to Joker, if I can. Did that, did that actually do anything? It did, yeah, okay, cool. Because I'm pretty sure these are Joker's bad guys, so if we just, convince him to work with us. That should be good. So let's get to switch over to Joker, which is right here. Yeah! Hi, guys. Okay, boss. <laughs> yep, we're A-OK. -okay. Move back over this way, and they're gonna help us out. Perfect, keep pulling. What's on the other side? It's a red brick, awesome! So there we go. I accept this on behalf of Batman villains everywhere. Yo, Harley, I did it! <laughs> He did it! All right, so let's try to look for the kit. Wait, is that it? Right here? Wait, is it as simple as this? No way. No way is it as simple as this. But I think that might be the kit inside of this. Yeah, they're definitely, I can see it in the tube. Is this the last one then? Have we finally finished five levels? That would be awesome. Come on. Oh, there we have it. So that's kit five out of five. Secret character, red brick, gold bricks, picture. Stud meter all done, let's exit the level, save and exit, I am so happy about that, oh my gosh. Took a lot of work. Okay, so Arkham, barely believe it. How awesome is that? And uh, we got over three million studs with all the collecting we did there, it's pretty cool. I guess uh, the scientist who made the, the Monster Man. And uh, the Minikit Detector is not so bad, I'm gonna equip that as soon as I can. Maybe we'll start that at the beginning of the next free play episode, we'll actually go and Activate that that red brick, the mini kit detector, and all the other ones too. Why not? Anyways, what is our secret character along with the other characters we've already unlocked? We unlocked Firefly, which I don't know too much about. But hey, that is pretty gosh darn cool. That means we have gotten five levels done in today's episode. We'll get another five done in the next replay episode. But for now, that was a lot of hard work. Okay, so I am so glad with our progress. It took a lot of harder and worked on, on my side. Hopefully it was still a fun video to watch for you guys, but level one, two, three, four, and five, got that golden star next to them. Next episode will be doing the next five levels. The episode after that will do five more, and then the episode after that will do five more, and then we'll be done with everything. That'll be very, very cool. But uh, for now, I think that's gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Lego DC Super Villains. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Zebra Kit, so now you've watched the end of the URA Zebra Tastic Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.